Hello and welcome back. Today I'm going to talk to you about metadata or document properties, however you want to phrase it. That's okay. There's lots of different terms out there, but it's really the data around the documents within your environment and how to amend those properties or metadata from either the web browser within a web application like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, etc or from the desktop applications themselves of Word, PowerPoint, or Excel. So without further ado, let's get started. So here I am in Microsoft SharePoint and I have a metadata column here called test information. And it's just a simple choice column that I have created with choices one, two, three, which are the default metadata options. That's not important. If you want information on how to create metadata, you're going to have to find that in another video where I talk about that. But for today's purposes, we are going to open up this document, test document, and we're going to amend the metadata. So first, what you could do here is you could click this little check mark, come over here to the I, and then once that's open, you scroll down to test information and do choice. And we can name it here as well. This is a title. Once we click out, it'll save it. We're good to go. We can click outside the eye and now we are good. There is another way to do this, however, when we're creating a document or when we have a document open in the browser. So let's go ahead and click on the document. That has opened up the document into a web application of Microsoft Word. Now inside Word, we can go to File, then we can go down to Info. Mine says to use full functionality of Word, open in the desktop app. We'll go ahead and click that. Once in the desktop application, we're gonna go to File, then we're gonna go to Info, then we're gonna go down here to Show All Properties. Then that's going to show us a list of all of the different metadata that we can choose. So we can say Category, Choose your category, choose your subject, your hyperlink, what company, status, whether it's not started in progress completed, key points, or any other personalized metadata that you have within this document library. Then, since it already is auto-saved, you can simply just ensure that it has saved and then X out of the document. And that's all. That's all you have to do to amend the properties within a document is you go to file, then you go to info, and then you amend those properties within your document. And you can do that from within the web application or the desktop application. If there are any other tips and tricks that you want, any other shortcuts that you'd like to see, hit those in the comments below. Please like and subscribe before leaving this video. And until next time, guys, see you.